love is coming your way. And with this, with this love, with this creativity, you're attracting good people in your life. And you're going to do good things with it. And rejoice in it. You know, don't stagnate, circulate. <laughs> um, you know, Venus actually is a motivating planet. It's not just lazy. Venus has an agenda. It has an agenda to create. It has an agenda to be in relationships. And, you know, be in a relationship, you, you, you got to do stuff, you know, like, like take a bath and, you know, clip your nails and make your hair look good. I mean, this is pretty universal, all genders and types. Yeah, do that stuff and attend to your creative projects and more money's coming your way. I mean, I see when now that Mercury's in your second house too, along with Jupiter and the sun, you're going to make it, you know, wealth is coming. You don't have to fear it. It's coming and um, helping your siblings, you know, with every experience or trauma they've been, just giving them love and encouragement is huge right now. We're a lot more powerful than we think we are. Your creative energy is great. You have incredible visions right now of what you want to do creatively, do it, <clears throat> especially this um, Friday. I'd say if you're watching this today, go ahead, start on that project, get it done. Um, you've got it. And your desires for um, travel and further education, go ahead and look into that. They deserve to be pursued. You have something coming on that is beneficial to you. And, and we want to make sure that you fulfill that, that you do that work, you do that service, and it's going to come back to you tenfold. All right. Well, greetings, Sagittarius. Welcome to your horoscope. So this is the last week of uh, Sagittarius. Next Friday is going to be the changing of the guard in, uh, in the tropical zodiac. So I mean, you really look like a winner this week. I'll, first of all, I'll have to say that, OK? Um, moon's in your fourth house, so it's like in a way it's a powerful moon, you know, today and 